माई डियर अचीवर्स वेलकम टू दिस येट अनदर मिशन मिड टर्म वन शॉर्ट सेशन ऑफ फोर्स एंड लॉज ऑफ मोशन आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू आर एबल टू हेयर मी वेल सो जस्ट लेट गेट दिस फॉर्मैलिटीज डन ऑडेबल एंड विजिबल लेट मी नो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल गुड इवनिंग यस सॉरी माई बैट गुड इवनिंग एवरी वन नमस्ते हेलो सब बढ़िया यस क्लियरली ऑडेबल एंड विजिबल फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट मी नो फर्स्ट वेरी क्विकली नाइस थैंक यू तालिब Good evening, good evening, people. Nice hobbies and craft has given me a thumbs up. Ah, huh? audible and visible. Thank you, Prabhat. Badiya, badiya. Hey, Talib. Waalaikum assalam. Yes, Satriya Kal. <laughs> All right, people. So this is the session of one shot. Means we'll cover this whole chapter in one go, which means. you should be ready i hope have you revised this chapter has uh, have you missed any of the session i won't say have you attended because attended to i know most of you have attended the session has any one of you missed the session the previous sessions of force and laws of motion come on revise now very good very good nice tejaswini this class is little early is it nahi nahi we are started on time sorry i know what you mean it's okay it's okay uh the timing issue is there slightly but we told you for class 9 c 5 pm is the slot which we could find and and most of you are able to join you missed up so theek hai people today i'll clear everything but in case in case one or two things you miss right you can watch those concept capsule session also again because everything was covered in great detail in small small chunked session right so that's why that's our deal let's start revising force and laws of motion oh nice darsh so you will be very attentive ha huh? nice thank you numan talib welcome make sure you subscribe to the channel ha huh? sneha motion first this and then motion hindi sonali hindi I can explain in Hindi. मैं हिंदी में समझाऊंगा आपका कुछ मिस नहीं होगा बट द थिंग इज आई वॉन्ट यू टू विद यू नो बी कंफर्टेबल विद इंग्लिश ऑल्सो एंड दैट इज मोर इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज पता क्या होता है जे ई नीट आगे हम पढ़ाई करते हैं बी टेक एम बी बी एस कुछ भी करते हैं ना इंग्लिश बिकम्स वन हर्डल आई डोंट वॉन्ट यू टू बी अंडर कॉन्फिडेंट इन फ्यूचर हमारे साथ तो हो गया है ना वी टू का लॉर्ड ऑफ टाइम इन बिकमिंग सो आई वोट से नॉट वेरी मच बट स्टिल मैनेजेबल वी कैन कम्युनिकेट वेर इन इंग्लिश इट्स ओके but i want you to be more confident than i was theek hai isliye english we will do you will not miss anything in hindi also i'll keep a good balance hai na uska promise hai koi koi tension wali baat nahi yes don't worry people english hindi nobody will miss anything right chalo so let's move you saw the video right so nowadays you are seeing this pattern every session in the beginning there is one video right hai na atoms and molecules okay arjun dost I just know one line from one song. Ami tumar bhalo bashi iske alawa I don't know anything. Yes. Duration. Duration will be about fifty minutes. Yes, it's a concept pack session in less time. That's true, right? Correct. So you saw the first video, right? Oh, it's okay, Manisha. Take care, ah. Huh? Chalo. I have with kaha conservation of momentum. Yes, true. This something we haven't covered yet, but I promise you, I'm going to give you a video on this. This I have talked to the team. They are working on it. Okay, chalo, chalo. Manat, this comment I would say put in the comment section. The team takes a look at it and they will start planning for you, है ना? Yes. So right now, not in the plan as such, but yes, ICC Olympiads are there. But this particular thing you can put in the comment section. The team will have a look. Chalo, ठीक है, guys. I am going to start. I am going to be in the zone, which means if I don't respond to all your comments, it's okay. Relax. But you can ask your questions, है ना? I'll keep reading. I'll also, I'll also answer. But I won't be distracted from the session. We have to cover a lot of syllabus in this next forty-five minutes. Means we have to be focused. We have to be quick, and we have to be attentive. चलो. So, Anthe, I'll just repeat three things for Anthe. First, completely free. Class seventh to class twelfth. very good exam very important exam 100% scholarships and 
a trip to NASA. That's something which is like a prize reward. And the moment you log in, the moment you register, in the link, there's a, there's a uh, description, there's a link given to you, you know. That link, the moment you register, you will get four mock tests also for Anthe. Sir, what is Anthe? Akash National Talent Exam. Very important, very prestigious exam. And if you prepare for this exam, you also get to prepare for J and NEET. And this is a pattern we have noticed. People who do well in these exams, they end up doing really, really well in J and NEET also. Means, prepare it. At least register for it. Give it. You will have a very good idea of future mein kya hone wala hai, na? what will happen in future. So, I have, my suggestion to you is make sure you register for it. It's free. Entirely free. Koi paisa nahi wala, hai? Yes. Nice. Slippers for Ante. Slippers for Ante is your great slippers only. Don't worry. Yes, Dash. Definitely. Exams are on, see, November is the month, hai na? 5th to 13th is online, 6th to 13th is offline. So make sure you register and enroll for free. Class 7 to 12, it's a, it's a big uh, uh, chunk of classes which are giving this, hai na? All India level pay. Aur kya chahiye? Make sure you register, hai na? Theke? Chalo. Now what we are doing, see, Ante ke liye we'll have sessions. We'll tell you, Slabus is your great Slabus, by the way. Ante ke liye, we'll take care. Don't worry, we'll give you more sessions. But now the focus is on boards right now in this session. It is the mission midterm, a race to 100% in your midterm exams. Means we'll give you chapter revision PDFs. That's true, right? We give you exam focus questions, doubt solving. Ha, this is something new and you will enjoy it. Don't worry. Na? But before doubt solving, make sure you revise everything. Neto, doubt solving, mein aake, I don't want to hear, sir, chapter padha dijiye. Don't say, sir, please teach us the entire chapter. No, that should not be a doubt solving session. Na? All right. Chalo, theek hai? And this question, I think it will, it will come again, Ankit. So I'm just uh, telling this right now. I won't repeat this. Huh? SST, ka, it's... I won't say revision. It's being covered. Thoda late start kiye hum log, it's being covered. Wo hoga. Chutega nahi. Revision mein thoda sa ho sakta hai ki aapko revision ka utna zyada time mile, jitna science and math mile, right? You might not get that much time for SST as you are getting for science and math. So my suggestion is cover science and math first and SST ko, it's okay. Thoda sa. It's, it's a little late but it's not stopping. So make sure it's, it's covered. Na? PDF. I'll tell you where the PDF is there. One shot marathons and mock tests complete, right? So which means people who are new, I'm telling you, make sure you first of all like, right? Make sure you subscribe also with the bell icon because then you will know what we are doing and you will get a notification. Definitely, right? Yeah? We give you schedules also, exact schedules. You can plan your days and week ahead. Okay? Be a subscriber. Then you'll know. Okay, your question was, sir, how do we get notes? Here. Telegram, right? Yes, Telegram is something which will get the notes and link is there in the description, right? Make sure you are a part of this channel. This is where I give you notes, I give you questions, I give you homeworks. Good, good channel. No spamming, faltu cheez nahi hota ispe, na? ispe, We just talk business and no wasting. No time wasting, I would say. Okay? Right? Chalo, everyone. Let's start talking with a word which is in the name of the chapter. Force. What is force? Chalo! What is force? Sonali, not today. We'll have session for this, but not today. Chalo. Oh, thank you, Himani. Same to you. <laughs> push or pull, right? Correct. Right? It's a push or pull. FBD, 11th class, Neetu. But haan, hai. I'll, I can tell you. Teach you is easy. No, 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 no. Force is not pressure, no man. Force is not pressure. See, easy, it's the easy. What's the easiest thing you can think of? Push or pull. Whenever you go to a restaurant or any gate, there is written something called as either push or pull, hai na? Either you push to open the door or you pull to open the door. So basically, force is nothing. It's just a push or pull. Simple, hai na? There cannot be an easier definition than this. What is force? Sir, push or pull. Khatam. The end. Or kya? Hai na? So, force is a push or pull acting on an object. That is something which you call as force. Easy. Chalo. So, ha, yes, force per unit area is pressure. Correct. And I would say normal force per unit area is pressure, right? Okay. Nice. Inertia and first law of motion. So, force is from where the story started. Now came three laws, right? And who gave these laws? Whose name is there? Yes. Shruti, not well, but yes, sir, well done. Nice. And what is the unit of, correct, Newton. And by the way, you know the reason of asking this question is, 
that is also the SI unit of force. So if you remember this, sir, it is the Newton's laws of motion. Forces, SI unit is Newton only. So you will not be confused. Na? So whatever you are answering, you are actually answering the name of the SI unit of force also in a way. So SI unit of force is named after Sir Isaac Newton in honor, obviously. Na? Okay, correct. Little confusing, Q, bhai? Force kya hai? Push pull hai. Newton kya hai? What is Newton? Newton is the name of the SI unit of force. Yes. Sir Isaac Newton is the name of the scientist. Right? Correct? Ha. Yes. Very good. Alright. Clear? Chalo. Now, let's start with how our ancestors, ancestors may how the great thinkers. So Aristotle was one of the very famous uh, ancient philosophers, scientists, I would say, theoretical, uh, I would say he gave a lot of analogies or theories. So Aristotle used to believe that rest is the natural state of all objects. Today you and me might say, Kya sir, we know it is not true. But he had his reasons and they were pretty valid. Everybody thought, yes, you are right, sir. Aristotle, sir, you are right because Yes, I also, whenever I push something, it stops. Whatever I do, things stop. Means rest seems to be like the natural state. Her body ko rest me aana achha lagta hai, iska matlab. And their natural state is rest. Okay. But then came Galileo. Galileo said, no, you know what? Rest is not the natural state of objects. He, he might not say why, but he said rest is not the natural state of objects. So let's discuss why at least we think that rest is the natural state. Hai na? Kyun? Right? Hai na? <laughs> yes, come on. Then I'll come to this. There's a flow I'll, I'll keep. So everything will be covered. You just have to be focused and listen carefully. So usual suspect. Now you all know, right? If today I push anything, essay, essay, it stops. Why? Because of, right? Why? Oh, nice, Imani. Very good. Why? Where focus? Friction. Correct, Dash. Nice. Very good, Abhinit. Friction. 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 Hai na? Right? Divanshu, today no menti. Aaj hum revise kar rahe hai pura chapter. To aaj questions nahi hai, but concepts hai sare. Then we'll have. Right? Ha. Correct. Right? Friction. Today you and me all know, sir, it is friction because of which the body is stopping. If I say friction is zero and if I push a body, it will just keep on going zoo. Right? Hai na? True. So that's true. Okay means friction is the problem. The friction force acts opposite to the direction of motion. Achha, ek baat batao. This statement, may, am I missing something over here? Am I missing one word over here? If I say direction of... There is something which I always tell you. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uniform, no. Opposite, no. Body, no. Motion, uniform. Shrinivas, relative. Till now, we have just discussed force only. Huh? And we are starting with Newton's first law. Relative motion. So, friction. So, this statement is not wrong. Because right now, the idea is not to define friction. The idea is the friction force act opposite direction of motion. It's a simple statement, not technical one, just for you and my understanding. But when you try to define friction, what do we say? Friction opposes relative motion. I told this already, right? friction, if you say that friction opposes motion, not true. It opposes relative motion. Why? We'll, we'll talk about this, don't worry, not, not right now. Right? Yes. Alright. Now came the first law of motion. And you were asking about inertia, right? So, Ali, not required right now. This is not a relevant question. Ask good questions. Hello, Newton's first law of motion. Okay, first law of motion. We also call it as the law of inertia, right? And inertia, I know, I'll explain you inertia, don't worry. But I'm just telling you, Newton's first law of motion is also called as law of inertia, right? Sir, what is inertia? I'll teach you, I'll tell you, don't worry. But let's look at the law first. The body or a body at rest will remain at rest and a body in motion will remain in motion until and unless it is acted upon by an external unbalanced force. Looks big, na? The, the statement looks big. So in my, in my concept capsule session also, I have, I have told this to you. This statement is not something for you to cram. Sir, first law, kya hota tha? a body at rest will remain at rest. Then a body at motion will remain in motion. 
Don't cram it. Understand it. A body will maintain its state. If the state is of rest, it will remain at rest. If the state is of uniform motion, it will remain in uniform motion. But kab tak? Until when? Until and unless there is a net external force acting on the body. Tab tak. Okay? Easy. Body will maintain its rest until and unless there is a net external force acting on it. Hai na? Easy. Correct. Yes. It defines qualitative idea about motion. Very good, Dash. Yes. Correct. Right? So, important words. I'll tell you keywords also. The things which we miss. External unbalanced force or you can also say net external force. Right? Both are correct. Both are correct. But it should be. Don't just say force. Wo galat ho jayega. Okay? Right? So, external unbalanced force. Bhai, if you apply two balanced forces, force is still there. It's just net is zero. So that's why net unbalanced force. Right? Got it? Okay, okay. Chalo. First law is clear. Easy. What will happen if there is no friction? Shruti, in, in, uh, in space, there is no friction. No? So, asteroids just keep on floating for years and years and years. Why? No one is there to stop them. Who is stopping them? Right? So, that's why. Repeat. Kare. Chalo, hai. I'm repeating everyone. First law of motion. First law of motion is a body will try to maintain its state of rest or of constant motion. Matlab, body bethi hai, bethi rahegi. Body chal rahi hai, chalti rahegi. Kab tak? Jab tak ki net external unbalanced force nahi lagta hai. In English, okay, that was in Hindi, I am repeating in English. A body, if it is sitting, will like to sit. If it's moving with constant velocity, will move with constant velocity until when? Until there is a net external force acting on the body. Okay? Repeat it both in both the languages. Okay? Yes? Yes. Alright. Correct, Sunali. Very good. Chalo. Now, there was a word inertia, right? Hai na? So, first law, because of first law, we said, if you ask me, sir, why will the body keep on, you know, maintaining its state? Right? Hey, Disha. Nice. Numericals, don't worry. Traveler's Paradise will take care of numericals. A lot of numericals will solve. Eh? Ayan, I must... You can choose... You have so many options. Na? It's a good thing. Inherent property, right? So if you ask me, I'll tell you. See, students ask. So sometimes my students ask also, Sir, why? Why is a body... Boy, why is a body trying to maintain its state? Maybe of rest, maybe of constant motion, but why? Because a body has a property called as inertia. Sir, what is inertia? So inertia is, it is a property of a body which allows it or which inclines it to maintain its state. So inertia is three types of There are three types of inertia. First is inertia of rest. Remains in state of rest until an unbalanced force acts on the body. Now, what is it? You don't have to learn this thing. Inertia of rest means a body likes to be in rest until unbalanced force acts on it. Alright, okay. Hai na? Crystal clear, na? very good. Next, inertia of motion. Acha. Sir, should I cram this? No need, no. Inertia of rest was a body likes to be in rest. Inertia of motion is a body likes to be in motion until unbalanced force acts on it. Simple, right? Easy. Natural tendency, right? Hai na? Nice, Anali. Yeah, I'm coming to this, this example. Don't worry. Alright. So every, every time this unbalanced force is common, if you, if you see. Hai na? Baki kya? Rest is all same. Inertia of rest, like to be in rest. Inertia of motion, like to be in motion. Until, unless, unbalanced force acts on it. Simple, easy. Hai na? Chalo. Inertia of direction. With this, I would say, I don't even need to teach this. Inertia of direction. Sir, unbalanced force to will be there. It will be there. But what is the starting of the sentence? Starting of the sentence is, a body will like to maintain its direction. Until and unless there is a net external force acting on it. Or there is a net unbalanced force acting on it. Simple, hai na? Nice. Correct. <laughs> How to calculate inertia? Huh? Inertia is a property. We don't calculate it, Nitika. But there is a way. We can think which body will have more inertia, which body will have less inertia. And this is the question I think uh, Sonali was mentioning, right? Hai na? Why is it advised to always wear a seat belt while driving? You can answer this. Thank you, Nama. That's good, basically. Nice. Yes, Abhiji. True. <laughs> Laziness. Huh? That's one way. A body is lazy. Right? Hey, hi, Nitra. Yes, come on. Inertia of motion. Yes, true. We will move forward. Correct. Hai na? 
because you know this i don't need to explain this because whatever we have done it's a very physical or i would say experiential thing we all have experienced this you are sitting right the bus is moving suddenly the driver applies brake and you like oh 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 are you are what why because your body is in a state of motion it wants to be in a state of motion because of inertia of motion but if suddenly the bus stops your feet are in touch with the you in touch with the floor of the bus or let's say car your feet to stop but upper part of body ko pata hi nahi hai it is still thinking i'm moving and it oh sorry sorry i was i was moving right inertia of motion simple na so that's why seat belts when the car stops abruptly due to inertia of motion our body continues to move forward so we can collide with the steering wheel or windshield seat belt provides us safety from this particular thing easy hai na correct yes body experience the ex external force who stopped the body the seat belt stop no <laughs> yes shruti all right correct to avoid accident so see why why am i showing you this answer because in exam sometimes what problem we face sir i have a lot of ideas in my mind but i am not able to write it hota hai na english hindi ka thoda jhol ho jata hai सर मेरे दिमाग में आइडिया बहुत सारे हैं लेकिन इंग्लिश में उसको अच्छे से लिखना कैसे ये समझ नहीं आता ऐसे सो फर्स्ट आई एम डिस्कसिंग आइडिया विद यू नाउ आई एम शोइंग हाउ टू राइट इट प्रॉपरली व्हेन अ कार स्टॉप्स एब्रप्टली ड्यू टू इनर्शिया ऑफ मोशन आर बॉडी कंटिन्यूज टू मूव फॉरवर्ड है ना यू फिनिश द फर्स्ट पार्ट सर हम मूव करते हैं बिकॉज ऑफ इनर्शिया ऑफ मोशन फाइन इफ सो वी कैन कोलाइड विद स्टेरिंग व्हील एंड द सीट बेल्ट स्टॉप्स अस फ्रॉम डूइंग सो राइट है ना कामिनी जस्ट रिपीट इट राइट इजी क्रिस्टल क्लियर बढ़िया Darsha, law of conservation. Be, I'm going to give you a video very soon. The team is working on this very soon. I'll give you a proper video, and this is for all the ICC and Olympia session also. Yep, very good. Badiya. Momentum, Sonali. I'm coming to it. Don't worry. Momentum, as such, is the, the quantity of motion. Uh, you know, a body contains mass times velocity. होता है. <laughs> Clear? चलो, बहुत अच्छे. बहुत बढ़िया, बहुत बढ़िया. चलो. Examples of inertia. Now let's talk about examples of inertia. And, and I'm telling, I'm telling you. All these are examples which I don't even need to tell you. You all have seen that. बचपन में ना ऐसे फल तोड़ते हुए whenever you were just trying to pluck mangoes or apples from a tree, you were doing this, है ना? When you want to just pluck, I would say जामुन के पेड़ होते थे, you know? What do we say जामुन in English? I don't know. So, hey, what do we say जामुन in English? I'm not, I'm not remembering the name. हाँ, uh, fruit detaches, right? So Nali, this is me preparing you for physics. इनर्शिया ऑफ मोशन खुशी कुछ नहीं है इनर्शिया ऑफ मोशन क्या है बॉडी लाइक्स टू बी इन मोशन अंडर अनबैलेंस फोर्स एक्ट इट भाई बॉडी को मोशन में रहना है कब तक जब तक अनबैलेंस फोर्स नहीं लगता ब्लैकबेरीज हाँ इज इट हाँ जामुन बोल दे राइट ओके चलो ब्लैकबेरीज और राइट चलो यस मोमेंटम इज डायरेक्टली रश्मि राइट सो एग्जाम्पल ऑफ इनर्शिया डिटैचमेंट ऑफ फ्रूट वेन ट्रीज विद क्या करते हैं हम लोग वेन यू वॉन्ट टू जस्ट ड्रॉप जामुन फ्रॉम द ट्री जस्ट शेक द ट्री है ना एंड इट इट जस्ट फॉल्स वाई द फ्रूट वॉज हैंगिंग फ्रॉम द ट्री एंड यू शुक द ट्री ऐसे 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 सो वट है फ्रूट ओ द ब्रांच मूव द फ्रूट स्टेट देर एंड इट फेल एंड दैट्स वाई ओके नाइस अरुण वेरी गुड Sonali, we'll take. Don't worry. After this, ke baad motion ke number hai. Pehli ye, pehli ye chapter. Force and laws of motion, right? So next, coming out of dust when we hit carpet with sticks. This is what we do. Agar, agar if our parents tell us, hey, you know, remove dust from this blanket, remove dust from this mattress. What you do? You just come back with a big stick, ha, huh? and then you start beating it. Thump, thump, thump. Hai na? You do that, no? Why? To remove the dust. Easy. Why? Again. Dust particles have inertia of rest. They want to be in rest, but the moment, let's say, let's say this is the dust particle, right? I don't have anything. If I have dust particle, if I beat the mattress, dust particle remained here. The mattress went away and dust particle fell. Easy, huh? Yeah, you know? Yes. Ha. Huh, cricket. <laughs> cricket hota hai. That's true. Correct, Chabuji. Very good. Huh? Inertia of rest. So I want you to also notice. Which body has inertia of motion? Which body has inertia of rest? Anna, that is important. You should know that. Anna, nice example for momentum. Any body, any body which is moving, it has mass, it has velocity, it has momentum. Bus. Any body you can think, car, bus, bullet, everything. Ah, yes, Anna. Chalo. 
body moves forward when we crashes a bike now I won't explain this I will ask you which inertia which inertia is this which inertia is this come on yes that's impulse we will talk about force into time but not now which inertia is this which inertia of motion yes this boy was in inertia of motion suddenly the bike crashed same thing which happened with you while sitting in a car hai na? seat belt it was inertia of motion same thing happened with the student inertia of motion right so easy Chalo. now came a question which you asked sir can we measure inertia I will say no I will say but you can tell which body will have more, more inertia how will you tell mass if a body what is mass it is the amount of matter a body has right if a body has more mass it has more inertia why I'll give you a very easy example if a very if a truck is coming to you with 2 meter per second hai na? if a truck is coming to you with 2 meter per second and a hollow plastic ball is coming to you with 10 meter per second who will you be afraid of truck se dar lagega ke ball se dar lagega tell me come on you will be afraid of the truck or the ball truck na why why because truck has more inertia you know that truck ko rokna mushkil hai even though its velocity is very less you have to it's very difficult to either start the truck by pushing or stop the truck by pushing why so much mass but ball ball ka kya hai you just poof, it went right it's, it's light very less mass inertia is very less very quickly you can bring it into motion very quickly you can stop it so inertia is telling you that mass is actually a measure of inertia more the mass more is the property of a body to maintain a state of rest or motion means more is the inertia easy take care momentum is very easy don't worry darrow mat momentum se. i'll teach you right ha, nice so inertia of a inertia of a both right inertia of both of them depends on mass so inertia, uh, inertia is actually a i would say mass is a measure of inertia right Dharya, aise hi hoga jai. Foundation, you should be clear right now. And this is what we are clearing the foundation. Ah, chalo, dhike, dhyan do. Inertia is not even a physical quantity. Inertia, scalar vector, to tab aata na. I would say, if you want to ask me, I would say, sc scalar quantity. Lekin, it's not a quantity, it's a property of a body. Hai na? So, inertia ke liye kabhi question aega nahi as such. Iner ke inertia, scalar hai ke vector hai. Agar a jata hai, galti se, scalar likh do chup cha. Right? Hindi English dono mix rahega dost but you will understand everything and I would say thoda na just start getting uh, just comfortable with English also thoda English bhi seekhna zaruri hai yaar future mein bohut dikkat aata hai I'm telling you maine bohut jela hai chalo momentum and second law of motion theek hai right focus guys right momentum and second law of motion so first law is clear the law of inertia easy we have discussed inertia we have discussed the first law everything is done अब बात करते हैं सेकंड लॉ की सो क्या होता है द फर्स्ट लॉ द फर्स्ट लॉ वाज मोर अबाउट अ क्वालिटेटिव एनालिसिस व्हिच समवन ऑफ यू टोल्ड मी राइट समवन सेड इन द चैट इट इज अ क्वालिटेटिव एनालिसिस दैट्स ट्रू सेकंड लॉ हाउ डू वी रिमेंबर सेकंड लॉ टेल मी द इजीएस्ट वे वी ऑल रिमेंबर सेकंड लॉ कैसे इजी राइट नाइस करेक्ट इज जस्ट विनी है ना सबसे इजी पार्ट हाउ डू वी राइट थैंक यू नुमान मे बी सम डे Third law will come. After this, huh? Very big prince. F equals ma. Shivan is not P equals ma. That is not the second law. F equals ma is the ultimate way. We all remember second law. If anyone asks you, no, second law, what is it? 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 Second Two balls of different masses traveling at the same speed collide with the stumps as shown. Will they have same impact? So people who attended the last session, this is same by the way, right? Who attended the last session, they know. By here, this is the red wala ball, the cork wala ball. We all are afraid of it in cricket. If it gets hurt, it gets hurt a lot. This is a Costco ball, means a tennis ball, right? Which one? Will they have same impact? No. Achha, now tell me which one will have more impact which one will have more impact this red kukabura cork ball or the Costco wala 
लेदर वाला है ना समटाइम वी कॉल इट लेदर समटाइम वी कॉल इट कुकबूरर कॉर्क वाला रेड बॉल राइट है ना वी ऑल नो बहुत भारी होता है भाई है ना डर तो लगता है उससे वी ऑल आर अफ्रेड ऑफ इट ये ट्रू राइट द इम्पैक्ट प्रोड्यूस बाय द ऑब्जेक्ट डिपेंड ऑन देयर मास एंड वेलॉसिटी सी द थिंग इज इट्स नॉट जस्ट मास राइट इट इट्स नॉट जस्ट मास दैट डिफाइंस हाउ मच इम्पैक्ट विल बी देयर इट्स नॉट जस्ट वेलॉसिटी विच टेल्स यू हाउ मच इम्पैक्ट विल बी देयर वॉट एम आई सेम रिपीटिंग इन हिंदी है ना मास अकेले ये नहीं बोलता है कि कितना इम्पैक्ट होगा वेलोसिटी अकेले ये नहीं बोलता है कि कितना इम्पैक्ट होगा इट इज द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ मास एंड वेलोसिटी बोथ गॉट इट राइट सो दैट्स वाई वी आर सेइंग दैट क्वांटिटी इज व्हाट वी कॉल एज मोमेंटम राइट यस करेक्ट प्रॉम्प्ट इंसान और राइट यस हाँ यूर राइट यस राइट सो मास एंड वेलॉसिटी मिक्सड गिव यू एन आइडिया भाई अब डरना चाहिए राइट देन यू अंडरस्टैंड आई शुड बी अप्रेड ऑफ दिस थिंग आई विल हैव मोर इम्पैक्ट ये चोट लग सकती है इसके अंदर राइट इट कैन हर्ट मी दैट इज हाउ वी जज दिस राइट हे अनिंदता नो अभिनीत शेप एज सच वी डोंट टेक इन टू एक्शन रिगार्डिंग द इम्पैक्ट इट्स जस्ट हाउ मच फोर्स अ बॉडी कैन ट्रांसफर दैट इज समथिंग सो शेप पे आएगा प्रेशर राइट इट विल कम प्रेशर पॉइंटेड है फ्लैट है दैट इज समथिंग फॉर प्रेशर बट फॉर इम्पैक्ट वी टॉक अबाउट ओनली फोर्स ठीक है राइट हाँ मास टाइम वेलॉसिटी सो वॉट इज मोमेंटम नाउ लिसन गाइज यू वर सेम यू वर अफ्रेड ऑफ मोमेंटम लिसन क्या फुल नाउ वॉट इज मोमेंटम इट इज द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ मास एंड वेलॉसिटी ईजी है सर है ना मास है वेलॉसिटी है वट इज द ऐसा यूनिट एंड मोमेंटम का सिंबल इज पी सर वाई नॉट एम भाई If I write m equals m into v, which one is momentum? Which one is mass? You don't know, so that's why we said, "Arey, no, let's keep it p, right? Momentum is p equals mass into velocity. SI unit becomes kg meter per second. How, sir? Mass is kg, velocity is meter per second. So SI unit becomes kg meter per second. Easy. यहाँ भी कुछ नहीं है. Easy, right? चलो. Now I'll ask you something else. What will happen to the momentum of this snowball as it goes down the hill? This is an interesting question. For this, you should have watched a lot of cartoon. I won't say a lot of cartoon, but I have seen this thing happening very often in cartoons. What happens? Increase, ah, huh? right? Why? Ah, it will collect snow. Himani, why is friction? Acha friction. Himani, I'll teach you by the end. Abhi thoda na, I'll have to distract from the flow. But I'll teach you. It's easy only. Don't worry. Increase, na. Why increase? There are two reasons for it. How to increase? Because in the cartoon, what I used to notice was, it used to start with a small snowball, है ना? It used to start with a small snowball, ऐसे, 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 ऐसे. But when it starts rolling down, it collects more and more snow, and it also gains speed. So, in this case, it becomes double deadly, double dangerous. How? Momentum is increasing because of increase in mass also, increase in velocity also. अरे भाई ये तो बहुत खतरनाक हो जाता है, right? That's why. So snowball, its momentum increases as it goes down the hill, right? हाँ, because g is also applied. That's true, right? If a body rolls down, its velocity is increasing. But you are saying body is also becoming big, 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 big. Means mass is also increasing. बस तो mass बढ़ रहा है, velocity बढ़ रहा है. दोनों मिलाके तो भाई velocity तो बहुत momentum बहुत बढ़ रहा है, right? Easy, true, all right. चलो so newton second law of motion guys now focus very carefully ha huh? this is the part where i want you to just excel because market mein lot of students don't know this properly at least so today i want you to be very clear with this hai na focus listen well iske baad i'll take questions also from you hai na chalo second law of motion says the rate of change of momentum of a body is directly proportional to the applied unbalanced force in the direction of force again this statement looks difficult Looks complicated. I'll ease it down for you. First thing, sir, rate of change of momentum. Okay. What is the meaning of rate of change of momentum? If I ask you, what is the meaning of rate of change of displacement? मतलब how much displacement occurred in how much time? Same thing is the rate of change of momentum. How much momentum change occurred in how much time? That is what we call as rate of change of momentum. Easy, है ना? Right? So till here it's fine. Rate of change of momentum of a body. Till here it's fine. It is what? How much momentum changed in how much time? That is the rate of change of momentum. ठीक है? It is directly proportional. अब ये तो हमको पता ही है. Directly proportional क्या होता है? Applied unbalanced force. What is this? Net force. Net external force. In the direction of force. 
this is something how much momentum change occurred that is equal to or I would say that is proportional to how much external force acted in the direction of this change in momentum okay yes <laughs> yeah Shruti I know <laughs> correct delta B by uh, T correct <laughs> Chalo, focus focus Anna. now all right so just take this definition and start applying it let's say this was a ball which had a mass m focus now thoda sa derivation hai, but i want you to be very very clear with this and note it down what i'm doing mass of the ball is let's say m okay sir its initial velocity is u means this ball was already moving with a velocity u take care right okay now directly proportional matlab kya hota hai agar agar mass badega so momentum badega. velocity badega, to momentum badega. mass ghatega, momentum ghatega. means whatever change happens on this side same change happens on this side means same kind of increase hoga, decrease hoga, right so this is the book called directly proportional right chalo. initial velocity is u final velocity is v matlab final velocity is v matlab momentum change is going to happen no so if let's say a body was having a mass m it was moving with a velocity u now finally it has velocity v Anna, final velocity v hai. I don't know increase hai, decrease hai, I don't know but it is v Alag hai. we know this much it is different than u all right now time taken for this velocity change to happen is t okay now according to Newton's second law of motion force is proportional to delta p by delta t sir delta p is what change in momentum now whenever we say change change is what final quantity minus initial quantity right so what is the final momentum? What is final momentum? Keep on answering, keep on answering, come on. Archit, koi baat nahi. Uh, thoda miss hua, pehle dek, baat mein dekhla na yaar. Momentum baat karna hai, second law, uh, we are deriving, right? Chalo. What is this? What is the final momentum? It is mass times V. Nice, hai na? Because V is the final velocity. What is initial momentum? It is mass times U because U was the initial velocity. Iska matlab, it means change in momentum will be sir final momentum minus initial momentum means m into v minus m into u right means m into v minus m into u so at least we got change in momentum sir we need to find rate of change of momentum divide by time easy right so change in momentum you got divide by time so right this is what m into v minus m into u and that is exactly what you get right it's written over here now let me tell you one thing Whenever you remove the proportionality sign, when you remove this, equal comes and a constant comes, right? Equal comes and constant comes. We all know this. I'll, I'll run, guys. Chalo, focus, focus. Add k. But, sir, in f equals m, me, there is no k. There is no k. Okay, sir, but how a came? Now, listen to me. From this quantity, if I take m common, this will become v minus u by t. What is this? What is this? Nice. I, I have taught this before. Huh? What is k? It is a constant. Uh, action. M, v minus u by t. Kya hota? It is acceleration. Na? Simple. It is acceleration. It is the definition of acceleration. Rate of change of velocity. So it becomes m into a. Which means it should become f equals k into m into a. But we have a formula of f equals m a. Pata k kitna hota hai? K is equal to 1 k is equal to 1 but sir why 1 because we kept it simple by the time we had this constant already there were a lot of theories which were described and their constant were defined if we did not keep this k equals 1 if there was some value all the other theories would have to be changed so we kept it 1 simple because force to average gate comes now so I would say at your age and grade think k is 1 okay fine ah yes all right, so k is one. Fine, but yeah, a lumbar conversation ho jayega. That's true. So that's why you understood how f equals m a came. Ab f equals mass into acceleration. Unit becomes sir mass is kg acceleration meter per second square. So it becomes kg meter per second square or newton. Isko bolte hai newton. Got it? Easy, hai na? Ayan, I'm giving you more options. I would say, jo badiya lagya wo karlo. Right? Ha, balance rehta hai. So, do you know how the airbags work? Do you know how the airbags work? Iska, I'll tell you easy thing. See sir, force is mass into acceleration, right? 
Force is also rate of change of momentum. All right. So during an accident, the airbag inflates due to jerk. We all know this. When the head collides with the airbag, it increases the collision duration, hence reducing the impact. Don't cram it. No need to cram it. Dratna nahi hai isko. Bhai, force was how much? Force was I would say delta p by t. Sir, proportional tha. Arey chalo k laga do. Yeh chalo. I'll I'll keep it easy. I'll keep proportional only. Hai na? Delta p by t. Now, when let's say there is a crash, your head is going to strike up the steering. I know. Do it's a it's a painful thing to imagine. Let's imagine. Thoda sa hai na? Your head is going to strike the steering. Ultimately, velocity will become zero. That is true. Means change in momentum. Change in momentum will be same, है ना? M U minus zero because V is zero. Okay, sir. Now, if I just work on this T, if you increase the time, now force is inversely proportional to the time. You can see over here, right? Inversely proportional to time. मतलब if I increase the contact time, force will decrease. If I increase the contact time, force will. Did I say right? If I increase the contact time, force decreases. If I decrease the contact time, force increases. थोड़ा confused मैं कर गया, right? है ना? Denominator में अगर चीज को बड़ा कर दो, तो overall छोटा हो जाता है ना? We all know this, right? हाँ, delta p travels paradises change in momentum. How much momentum changed, right? हाँ, so we got this. Forces sir directly proportional to change in momentum, inversely proportional to time. If I increase the contact time, force decreases. If I decrease the contact time, force increases. And what is force? The impact. हमको चोट क्यों नहीं लगा? Because I increase the contact time by using a airbag, है ना? That's true. चलो, one more real life example for the all the cricket fans. No, 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 Shruti, not I. I won't take this question. चलो, catch a cricket ball. Notice this one method, है ना? This one method when a ball came and the fielder is like ah. I just catched it. Second one is this. What is the difference in the second one? Notice. Second one is more like this. Oof, right? You take a catch and you move your hand backward. Right? Ha! We bring our hand back. Why? Same logic. Airbag wala logic. Same. Bhai, ball you have to stop. Means change in momentum is going to be same. Hai na? You needs to come to rest. Means change in momentum will be same in both the cases. The difference created by time. Ha. Hai na? Right? Difference is created by time. If I move my hand back, I am increasing the contact time. Means force decreases. If force decreases, impact decreases. If impact decreases, chot nahi lagta hai. Hai na? I have to play the game yaar. Heart tod li to kaise hoga? That's why, right? Alright? Very good. I'm I'm glad you are understanding everything. Chalo, third law of motion. Very quickly, five minutes. Me, jaldi karenge. Newton, Sir Isaac Newton. We all know, right? So Newton said there is the third law of motion, and this one is very interesting, very important. It says for every action there is an equal and opposite reaction. Negative momentum. अच्छा ठीक है. So before this, I'll just give you one small thing because it's a good thing. Which Pratish asked. Negative momentum क्या होता है? Or is it even possible? It is possible. Why? Sir, momentum is mass into velocity. Velocity is a vector quantity, right? So momentum is also vector quantity, correct? Now velocity can be positive, negative or zero. Means momentum can be positive, negative or zero. Because this sign will tell you what? In which direction? Got it? Right? Ha, right? Correct? So that's why momentum can be negative because there is velocity. Velocity is a vector quantity. Velocity can be positive, negative or zero based on the direction it has. And that's why. अच्छा हिंदी में सुन लो नेगेटिव हो सकता है क्यों बिकॉज वेलोसिटी है वेलोसिटी क्या वेक्टर क्वांटिटी है ये पॉजिटिव हो सकती है नेगेटिव हो सकती है जीरो हो सकती है ठीक है अब प्लस माइनस जीरो हो सकती है तो भाई कौन क्या बता रहा है डायरेक्शन बता रहा है सो आई हैव टोल्ड यू इन इंग्लिश एंड हिंदी बोथ इजी ठीक है जस्ट बी बी राइट हां नाइस सो फॉर एवरी एक्शन देयर इज एन इक्वल एंड ऑपोजिट रिएक्शन सर इजी है ये तो इजी है ना दैट्स ट्रू इट इज इजी बट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग इज इट वर्क्स ऑन डिफरेंट बॉडीज राइट वेलोसिटी वेलोसिटी क्या होता है वेक्टर क्वांटिटी होता है राइट सो वेक्टर क्वांटिटी इज पॉसिबल टू हैव प्लस माइनस एंड जीरो राइट सेम टू डिस्प्लेसमेंट ना इफ आई गो फ्रॉम हेयर टू हेयर आई से पॉजिटिव डिस्प्लेसमेंट इफ आई गो फ्रॉम हेयर टू हेयर आई से नेगेटिव डिस्प्लेसमेंट राइट सो पॉजिटिव नेगेटिव टेल्स यू डायरेक्शन समटाइम्स इफ यू से सर पॉजिटिव राइट मतलब वेलोसिटी टू द राइट अगर अगर नेगेटिव इज लेफ्ट सो आई विल से माइनस टू मीटर पर सेकेंड मीन्स टू द लेफ्ट दैट्स योर कॉल ठीक है हाँ 
so that's why this was about velocity chalo for third law i'm telling you it is saying for every action there is an equal and opposite reaction i'll tell you a elaborate version acha third law ke liye na we have done a proper session on this if you have confusion go ahead watch it but i'm just giving you thoda sa halka sa quick version nice yes victor that's true right yes purna visible so focus 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 important thing about third law is if i'll take two bodies now if a body a applies force f on body b means body b will apply same f force on body a in the opposite direction theek hai why do i say this is a good definition because in this you will not make a mistake ki there are two bodies a applies f force on a sorry b means b applies f force on body a in opposite direction that is the third law of motion for example if let's say you are there your friend is there you you push your friend and your friend don't push you but what will happen both of you will move you pushed your friend your friend also pushed you okay same thing a boy is swimming matlab a boy is pushing the water back applying force on water back water is applying force on you in the forward direction that is why you are moving forward easy hai na right right chalo badhiya so these two forces are always equal in magnitude but opposite in direction very important thing hai na don't miss this and action reaction act on different objects now if you ask me sir can action reaction cancel out each other no why bhai do alag alag bodies pe lag raha hai that is why they don't cancel out each other right you said walking yes sir walking right so if when you are walking what is happening you are applying a force on the floor from your foot in the backward direction you are applying force on the foot in the backward direction right now floor is applying force on you in the forward direction right aditya 14th of august don't worry the floor applies a force in the opposite direction in the forward direction that is how action reaction is working right yes rashmi true directly proportional to change in momentum i would say theek hai hmm galat baat right chalo all right so easy third third example is uh, third law is easy but we have discussed a lot more detail for third law in our session jisko thoda sa bhi doubt hai please make sure you watch that third law session hai na now people a big announcement 14th of august something big is going to happen what is it take a hint from this picture i won't tell you more i don't know even more but 7th of august will tell you what exactly is this right hai na uh, so third law is very simple any problem na force ke concept capsule sessions are there make sure you watch them jahan bhi aapko dikkat hai right yes delta means change velocity velocity kya hota hai it is the rate of change of displacement displacement kya hota hai shortest distance from a point right that is the displacement to velocity kya bol raha hai kitna displacement how much displacement happened in how much time that is velocity bas hai na and it is a vector quantity nothing doubt bahut badhiya so people the reason i'm i'm showing this to you is because we have proof now whatever we do the way we teach and the way you guys respond it leads to a good result and that is the reason trisha's name is here right she did really well and by the way we have 2600 plus students above 90% means you can be next year let's go beyond this let's make new records and for which we want all of you to be very attentive sab kuch hoga academic se leke sab kuch but that means you have to be regular you have to be a part of this family theek hai yes so i think you all understand this we got you covered right theek hai initial momentum ka formula kuch nahi mass time velocity hota hai initial velocity u hai to m into u ho gaya bas hai na right so menti menti karenge but abhi animation pyara lagta hai ki menti acha lagta hai menti is good for questions but apart from that for teaching animation is good which means i'll i'll jab jab padhana hoga i'll take animation and i'll go for ppt hai na right both ha bas badhiya mere ko bhi dono acha lagta hai right make sure you press the like button this is very important right make sure you press the like button if you think this was a good session if you think we are helping you make sure you share don't be greedy ha huh? share it with your friends thoda then we'll have mega quizzes with all your friends ha huh? that's why share it with your friends and make sure you are a subscriber to the channel because we are doing a lot this mission midterm is for everyone for every grade for every uh, i would say for board also right so make sure you are a part of it theek okay? hai right
कंजर्वेशन मोमेंट पे आई गिव यू अ प्रॉपर वीडियो एक रिकॉर्ड करके भेजूंगा टीम इज वर्किंग ऑन इट डोंट वरी राइट सो पीपल टेक केयर कीप लर्निंग एंड तीनो करेक्ट है न्यूमेरिकल्स पे नेक्स्ट सेशन यस एंड विल मीट अगेन टिल देन बाय